with milks from hemp to oat to almond to yeah. soy, but drought can make the water loving crops unappealing to earth conscious lovers. Yeah, and that's why pistachio is the latest alt milk taking over California cafes. Joining us now with a taste, and we're gonna love this, by the way, is Kazra Saidi of Tash and Intelligentsia Barista, Jesse Fridlin. Good morning to both of you. Thanks for joining us. This smells amazing, looks amazing. We have a couple of questions. First of all, Kazra, why is pistachio milk a drought friendly alternative to almond milk? Well, almond milk actually uses 75% more water than pistachio milk. So in harvesting the crop, you actually have to use 75% more water in uh, you know, getting uh, almonds to produce as much yield as a pistachio tree. Okay, so I have not heard of pistachio milk yet, and I yeah. feel like LA is always ahead of the curve when it comes to the alternative milk. So it's really cool that we're talking about it, and importantly, getting to taste it. But before yeah. we do, what kind of milk does pistachio produce? Can it, Obviously, it can make foamy lattes. What would you use it for? What is it similar to? It's an extremely versatile milk. Okay, so I actually like it with cookies, so I drink tash and cookies. You can wow. make lattes with it hot or cold. You guys are going to try four different lattes today. Um, but it has all the health benefits of a natural uh, alt milk, but it's also um, very earth conscious with a 75% less uh, water footprint. And it has no added oils, which is extremely important. A lot of alternative milks have added oil. So it has added canola oil in a lot mm -hmm. of oat milks, which is very weird. That is odd. Right? Yeah. yeah. A lot of people don't know that, that there's actually canola oil or a, a seed oil inside oat milk to make it creamy. Huh. And so pistachios are naturally, they have a very healthy oil inside them. So you get that creaminess with pistachios that are naturally there without all the added oils that you know you don't want in your <laughs> latte. All right, that sounds good. Let's taste it. Yeah, Can you walk us through some of the the tasty treats yeah. we have in front of us? So you have four different lattes in front of you. You have a mocha to start, then you have a chai, you have a, a vino, and of course the seasonal beverage that we did with Intelligentsia, the pistachio rose latte. This is, let's let's cheers again, Carlos. <laughs> cheers. Mm, cheers. Okay. It tastes, it's good, actually. Drink it down. This is the mocha. That this is, is the, the mocha. mocha. Okay. And these are mm. all this made is good. with tash wow. as well. Mm. Did you make these? You're the yeah. barista, yeah. right? Yeah. Okay, so talk, talk to us about these lattes. Sure. Especially um, the pistachio rose latte. The pistachio rose. That is our new signature. Uh, we just brought it around for the new um, season. We're super excited. This is our first time partnering with Tash. Um, it's a really unique experience good. to partner with pistachio oh gosh, milk because we've delicious. never done it <laughs> but um, we're excited for everything you guys are gonna try personally I feel like as a barista mm -hmm. and working with milk all day every day um, we're, we're, you are you just <laughs> this is amazing yeah this is great <laughs> Love you. the foam yes uh, so you it guys... really makes incredible foam tash exactly it really does what, yeah. are, guys... these, what are these this and this this is so this is our chai latte made with tash and then this one right here is going to be the avena mm. it's going to be um oh my gosh. Yeah, so good, right? <laughs> and this, what is in this latte? In the Avena, so it's going to be a vanilla syrup that we make with a raw sugar. We make all our syrups in house, um, so they're all really yummy. Wow, but strong. we steep it with oh, cinnamon, orange peel, <laughs> ginger, put a little cayenne, so it's a little sweet, a little spicy, really good. So you guys have been around for two years? Yeah, Tash started two years ago. Yeah. Okay. It's about it. yeah. Well, it was founded actually by my sister, Roxana Sadie. Uh, we grew up, my dad's. Uh, Persian and pistachios are very big in Persian culture. So I think, you know, inspiration struck about five years ago. She said, you know, there's all these alternate milks out there. There's no pistachio. Let's give that a go. And it tastes incredible. Yeah, you right? wouldn't think, I wouldn't imagine. It tastes this good. Yeah. I'm loving it. You know what's funny about that? Casey recently, our um, weather person, meteorologist, brought in pistachios from Iran that were yeah. so amazing. Yes, yeah. And that's the trick is, you know, pistachios, they have a wide flavor profile. Some of them have a really deep richness, and that's the pistachios so that Tash uses. So there are some other on the market, but they blend a lot of different nuts. This is a pure pistachio, and you get that really, it's a, it's a mild flavor. It doesn't taste too much <laughs> like a pistachio like in your mouth, but it has that nuttiness. It's a little bit sweet. So it's a very good natural alternative to some of the alt milks that don't have a lot of flavor in them. So I you, think you're going to teach us how to I have make a quick question. one, right? Yeah, yeah. You teach it, but first of all, I want a quick question. Four of these is displayed here this morning. Which is your favorite? Be honest. Mm. And why? Ooh. My favorite is, of course, going to be the rose pistachio latte with intelligence because. 
we developed it together. It's been such an incredible process doing that. And I don't know, mm. Jesse, if you want to give uh, any, uh, you know, of your inspiration behind the drink. Yeah, of course. Um, I think of these lined up as well, though we made them all with Tash. This one we did. Um, we were very intentional with with pairing with the Tash milk, these different flavors. So in the rose pistachio, um, we make the rose syrup with a little bit of orange peel. So there's going to be a little bit of citrus if you taste that in that last one. And then we top it with um, cardamom and rose us. petals. <laughs> So it's going to be very floral, a little spicy, um, perfect for fall. And All right. Yeah. Well, you guys, thank you so much. These are delicious. Yep. The pistachio milk, I mean, I really wouldn't be able to tell it from any other milk. It just tastes like a good, creamy yeah. um, milk. So thank you. Uh, Tash is available at all Intelligentsia locations. You can visit pistachiomilk.com to learn more. Thank you both so thank much. Thank you. Cheers. 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 Yum. Done, but good. <laughs> <laughs>